Hey, uh, it's 7 a.m. and I'm on a two-hour drive to San Maria Airport because today is the day, the day of a paint stripping and I definitely don't want to miss that. Last time I saw my airplane was a week ago and uh, signs down they were removing flight controls, uh, we're taping everything, getting ready for uh, the stripping process. Here's my airplane. Looks like they've been doing the final touch ups and taping. It looks like they removed an entire tail cone with the tail beacon. They taped the spinner, prop blades, taped all the seams around the culling here, here. Avionics access panel. I'm glad they did this. I don't want any nasty stuff in my avionics. And uh, my windshield is the two-piece windshield. I didn't get a chance to replace this with one piece, so I have this thing in the middle. And sometimes it leaks a little bit of water, so I'm glad they taped an entire windshield. So it's almost ready for the paint stripping. Um, so how many um, how many coatings? They're gonna be just one or several? Normally it's gonna be one coating depending on how many layers of paint. So with this particular uh, plane, taping it up, there's already places where it's chipping, so it shouldn't need any more than one layer. Okay, okay. And when you tape everything, do you use only the foil or any other materials like on a windshield? Just want to make sure that nasty stuff doesn't get inside. Yeah, it just depends. Where anywhere where it's seamed, it's just going to be aluminum tape foil covering it. For anything that has plexiglass, for instance, the windows, and sometimes there's lights and other uh, other different lightings, it's always going to be triple layered. So for the windshield and the side windows on the fuselage, it's always going to be paper, aluminum, and plastic. For everything else that's going to be a plexiglass it's going to be paper aluminum so they tow in my airplane right now to another hangar uh, to strip the paint they have a better ventilation system there because the stuff that they will spray in the airplane is very nasty Now they're gonna let it sit for the night and uh, in the morning they plan to scrub some areas that didn't really pop and uh, then after some time they will pressure wash it. That's how it looks like on the next morning.
and that's it that's how airplane looks like after the pressure wash and what they will do next they will remove that tape and there is still paint under the tape like here they will use brushes to manually remove uh, tape in these areas I hear some corrosion that I was concerned about. Still there, needs to be treated. And some corrosion here and here on the tail. Um, around the inspection plate screws, 